As I look at my crystal ball, I see an internationally recognized city with high quality, high performing schools for all individuals, an environment of uh, respect and acceptance for all individuals regardless of race, gender, economic status, or personal preference. Uh, an educated community that was tolerant of each other, that appreciated the arts, that provided its young people with things to do, and was a place that everyone would want to live in. And just, uh, well, that, that's the Baton Rouge that I would hope to see. In 50 years, I hope that we have a lowered crime rate. I think that is part and parcel to what we have to do here to be happier. I think we will have a robust mass transit system. We'll have a high density downtown Baton Rouge with lots of amenities. And by high density, I mean residential. We will have um, people walking and biking around this uh, city. And I think we will have a public school system where everybody participates. I'd love to see us be free of concerns about personal safety. Let's have those basics that will allow our children to look forward to these developing their potential, enjoying life. In 2064, a community that's able to recognize that it is the diversity that actually makes us uh, the unity. It is being who we are. It is recognizing our different experiences and backgrounds and cultures and faith preferences and life. It's all of that that makes Baton Rouge Baton Rouge. It would just be a place that would be known throughout the country as a, a place to want to visit, but even more want to live and work and um, have a great time. You know, if we were to look at the indicators in that year that we would see Baton Rouge being the place that young people who are graduating from college, not only from across Louisiana, but across the whole country and even world, are choosing Baton Rouge as a place they want to go and to build on their profession and raise a family uh, where it's an open and creative and just inspiring place to live. So I hope that that's the kind of place that we will see in 2064. I can tell you what, based upon their track record, this 50 years, Baton Rouge will be the toast of the town, the toast of the nation, and people will be coming here from all over to see a place that's made a total transformation, but not without the help of the Baton Rouge Area Foundation.